Hi, I'm Dr. Ramchandra, cardiologist from Sri Sri Holistic Hospital at Nizampet in Hyderabad. ECG and an echocardiogram, which are of course routine tests, and then he does a stress test, which is a treadmill test. And in a treadmill, the person is actually made to exercise on the treadmill, and, and an ECG is taken to see if there is any decrease in blood supply to the heart muscle when the person exercises. See, when the person exercises, the heart itself beats much faster and needs more blood supply. So that if the heart tube is narrowed around 70 or 80 percent, it will not show up when the person is not exercising. But when he exercises, it behaves like a half closed tap and you know there is not enough blood supply to the heart muscle and this can be seen on an ECG or a treadmill test. Now the problem about these stress tests is that they will turn a positive only if those tubes are narrowed more than 70 to 80 percent. So, if it is less narrowed, your stress test will be normal. The third thing that the doctor does is of course, take some blood tests which are like, like I said for these risk factors. Many of these risk factors you do not know that you have them till you get them tested like you know diabetes, blood pressure, cholesterol all these things unless they are tested these are all silent killers which means they have no symptoms you need to test them and luckily you have these very easy tests like look at it like blood pressure very simple test you know it is just a cuff and you know what is the pressure inside the tube supplying uh, blood to the whole uh, body. So, very simple tests are there weight is very simple to take uh, you can have a lipid profile in a non fasting state things have become easy just you need to go to a hospital or some place and get these tests done. Healthy heart.